go, go for it. Okay. Oh, it's beautiful. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so you put the switch down, put the back, the switch back up. Yeah, go on then. Need it up, yeah. <laughs> it does throw you, try and throw you off the front quite um yeah. Some kind of wise guy, huh? On your first run, trying to do turns both ways. <laughs> you're, you're having trouble keeping up with him though, aren't you? <laughs> Mate, you're just a blur. Here he is. We need to be a bit stiffer on the control. <laughs> oh, very nice. It's still on, and now it's off. It's whatever. Okay, where's the flux capacitor? Right. <laughs> what we have is on this end, we have the controller, which has a gyro and two accelerometers in it. Yep some buttons for adjusting the control angle and the main on-off switch for the control. It's the main power switch. And ben, think QVC here. QVC. All right, here we have the main power switch. Lovely, nice red detail for you ladies. And of course, power switches, they, they're ideally Ooh. used for flicking on power, yeah? Yes, and flicking it off again. It off. Oh, you can turn it off and on? And on, yes. Right, okay. Here we have two sealed lead acid batteries. So Joke batteries? Batteries can be used for all sorts of things, can't they? They can. Like balancing scooters. Scooters. And vibrators. What? <laughs> we have belt drive, big DC motor. Which Where'd you can that see come under from? there. Don't ask questions for that. Came from eBay. You get right. told no lies. Okay. What, are that, what does that motor normally power? Uh, I don't know. Some kind of automated machinery. And there's an open source motor controller inside that box. Wonderful. Yes, and, that's and all it. in all, 